advocate and, and def defender of consumer rights. What do you think of the kind of service we have based on what you've seen tonight? Yeah, well, it was shocking and, and dreadful. And first of all, by the way, just out of interest, I wanted to say that in relation to the test that new taxi drivers have to have to pass um, in order to get their licence on, on area knowledge and the rules and regulations, um, there was there's a currently a 22% pass rate over the last number of months, which I think is very, very low. And then they just sit the test again. So that is an area, it seems, where some changes have to be made. But, you know, somebody here said that we should expect a good service. It's not that we should expect it. We're entitled to it. Um, and you're that, paying for it. You're paying for it. And that means a service should be carried out with the necessary skill, with due care and diligence, and, of course, all the rules and regulations that apply to the taxi uh, sector uh, be adhered to, whether it's to do with licensing, roadworthiness of vehicles, uh, taxi metering, whatever. Now... What do you think of the, the ratio? Nine inspectors for 42,000 yeah. uh, drivers and 25,000 vehicles? Yeah, it doesn't seem enough, does it? Now, we have the nine inspectors, then in addition, they do work with the Gardaí, and I'm told to go out about three times a month, is what I've been told, with the Gardaí on joint enforcement <laughs> actions. That's what I was told. I don't know whether that yeah, is true. You've got the but, stats. How many do they yeah, nail so far this year? OK, let's look at the fixed uh, payment uh, notices or fines of €250, Euros, 37 so far uh, up until the end of April, and 22 prosecutions. Mind you, while, why none of the people we saw in the primetime programme were prosecuted, I don't know. But enforcement is the absolute key, because without it, it undermines confidence and okay. trust so it's on less consumers' than part and damages the business for less the good than guys. Less 0.1 of 1 per cent. <clears throat> Uh, fines in the first yeah. few months of very, this year. Very, very small. And another aspect I think is important to say, because it feeds into the whole enforcement area, is that there is an official complaints procedure that is run by the taxi regulator. There, there have only been 100 complaints so far this year. So if you do have a valid complaint, you know, do use that as well, because that okay. can feed Does into weeding out any, the rogue traders Does anyone have any theory well? why people are not uh, complaining? Jerry, why people are not complaining? I, I don't know. The facility is there. People can complain. But one thing I want to say...